What up, y'all? What's going on, man? So, y'all know what I've been thinking about lately, man. With this Earl Spencer Terms Crawford fight, man, I've been thinking about how leading up to the fight before the fight was almost, you know, close to being done or whatever, Terrence Crawford always would mention how, like, he'll mention how, like, he he's done everything. He can retire today and go into Hall of and go into the Hall of Fame. You know, he 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 kept reiterating that and making that be known to people when he doing his interviews. He'd be like, "Man, you know, uh, this on Earl. I know already. You know, I'm pound for pound number one. I done, done. I didn't came up several weight classes. He ain't never came up as it as if this is the end game." You know, I've been thinking about that real deep, but it's crazy because it actually kind of is the end game for his eyes and everything like that. Like, he, it, it's kind of like it is the end game for him, though. You know what I'm saying? Because he finna be in a fight for his life with Errol Spence. You know, this shit finna get hectic. You hear me, y'all? This shit finna get real, man. So, Earl Spence had just uh dropped a... Uh, What's that uh, Instagram post? And he was like, kill or be killed. You know, he always... One thing about this nigga Earl Spence, man, he always dropping cryptic messages and <laughs> shit that you got. He always drop shit that you got to think about. He was like, hey, what that mean? So he said, kill or be killed. So you already know what time it is, man. So is this him signaling, you know, that the fight is done? Or... You know, I don't, I, I could, I think this, you know what I'm saying, uh, a meaning of multiple things. I kind of believe that mean, like, that's how he coming with the fight, period. Because if you've been following things, the energy been matching what he been saying. Like, when he, you know, he, like, probably, like, a couple of weeks ago, he posted Marvin Hagler. You know, with the famous cap on that say war. Everything like that, like everything he been saying, he coming for them eyes, bro. You can just tell, bro. Like you, it gotta be about the eyes, cause every time he say something, you know it. it, it it's almost like it ain't even no death threat. It's just like a message. You know how somebody threatening you, like I'm gonna fuck you up when I see you. His shit different. He like nigga. <laughs> he like he like nigga. It's war. Nigga, I'm gonna kill or be killed. You know, with the, uh, uh, I got one of them shirts too, but you got the shirts where you got like, uh, Earl Spence knocking on the doors and shit. You know what I'm saying? Blood under the doors. Like, yeah, all the doors. And him coming to take the straps. Everything that's been leading up to some dangerous shit, man. Bud is in a fucking fight for, I'm crying and shit. This shit's so funny. But Bud, man, he in, he in the fight for his life, y'all. This nigga, you know, in his eyes, this nigga, man, he in trouble. You know, Terrence Crawford keep coming to the channel. You know what I'm saying? I love that, man. Ref for y'all, boy. But but the shit Earl Spence on, I don't think Bud on that type of shit. I know Bud a dog, but I just think, like, as bad as we want to, as certain people want to see some boxing shit, right, I believe this finna be some fucking brutality of Viking type of shit. That's why I, that's why I keep telling y'all about how Earl come and take his eyes. Y'all think this a game. This nigga, this shit real. Man, he really finna come take his shit, bro. <laughs> he, finna take, he finna come take that boy shit. Bud been quiet as a motherfucking mouse. He ain't been saying nothing. Hey, y'all been paying attention to that, man? Bud is scared, man. He nervous as a motherfucker. He going to go see eye doctors every week. He going to go, you know what I'm saying, do spiritual motherfucking gatherings. He been meditating. He been doing everything, man. This fight is finna be some shit for y'all ass, man. I'm about to win so much money on y'all niggas, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. You know, uh... 
Yeah, I posted this on my community tab. Y'all know the picture where Earl had won that money from Ryan Garcia I posted? He was looking at Ryan like, that's how I'm be looking at child niggas after the motherfucking eyes pop out. I'm telling you, this shit finna go down. I believe the announcement finna be real soon, y'all. Probably like any week now, it's finna be announced because we already heard it, it, it coming like October. And I believe a fight like this needs some hell of a promotion. Like, this ain't no need to be no regular promoting, uh, like, uh, regular fights. You got your two or three episodes of fight camp and yeah, and yeah, uh, just the regular shit. We, we need to see more, nigga. This shit finna be crazy, bro. I'm so hyped for this fight, man. Because I'm about to win some money, right? But eyes going to fall out, right? Pop out. And, and y'all going to have the dick look. Because I told y'all last, man. Y'all niggas thought I was trolling. You can't troll me, by the way, but y'all thought I was trolling, huh? Man, Earl Spence on some different type of time than Bud, man. He on some whole other shit. I know Bud got the dog in him and all that, right? But that dog is what's going to get him left on his shield, you know. Earl Spence on some killer be killed shit. You know, every time these guys get in the ring, I would like to say, man, they all be on that type of shit, killer be killed, but they don't. They don't. These niggas be fighting to go 12 rounds. They be fighting to outbox you. They ain't coming. It's just certain fighters that's coming in on a different type of me, uh, mentality on, you know, they moving on a different type of frequency. They not coming to outbox you. They trying to pop them fucking eyes out and ruin you, bro. They trying to make your fucking mid, uh, they trying to make your motherfucking, <laughs> your motherfucking insurance shoot through the roof. They trying to make sure your dental plan go up. They trying to make sure, nigga, all your insurances go up through the roof. Telling y'all, man. So, Earl, Earl Spence just dropped that uh, post, kill or be killed. Everything that nigga post about this fight is on some whole other shit. There's nothing regular about this fight, man. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. I hope Bud got his shit together, man. He better have something to right. He better have some. He better have the best health insurance you can possibly get. You know, uh, I hopefully, I know he's fucking around with top ranking them and they don't really set you up like Al Heyman and Al Heyman do. So, you know, hopefully Terrence Crawford got the, uh, the million dollar life insurance because you can borrow from there. So, you know, he'll need that though. Cause I'm sure that shit costs a lot of money to get your uh, get some new eyes. So which one of you niggas? The question is the real question is which one of you guys, one of you turn Crawford fans, ready to donate child shit, man? I mean, y'all love the niggas so much. I mean, I'm sure y'all, you know, I would only expect for y'all to be ready to donate child shit. You know, pop them bitches out and hand them motherfuckers over. Go on here, bro. But it is what it is, man. Y'all smash that like button and subscribe. If you ain't subscribed already, make sure you hold that notification bell so you can get all notifications when I'm dropping these videos. Cause this shit finna be popping out like high cakes. We taking a little taking it easy right now. Soon this shit get to going, we're gonna smash the break. We're gonna smash these niggas. So it is what it is, man. Uh Bud is in a fight for his life, man. In his eyes. Literally, not figuratively, literally, you know, so it is what it is, man. I'm out, child deuces.